Welcome to Climax Scott's Football TV for a 2014 season opener segment. The Panthers opened the new season at Big Blue Stadium Friday and gave their fans a 12 to nothing win in the lid lifter. It wasn't the prettiest of season openers, but the Panthers overcame three lost fumbles and fought through a few more penalties than they would have preferred to come away with a win. Both teams appear to have some opening night jitters. Besides losing three fumbles, CS was flagged seven times for 57 yards. Athens was penalized five times for 36 yards, but lost five fumbles and had one pass intercepted. The CS defense frustrated Athens most of the night, holding the visitors to just 35 yards in total offense and two first downs. CS limited Athens to just four yards on the ground, while the home team rolled up 256 yards rushing. Taylor McNally broke the scoreless deadlock with a four-yard touchdown run with 7.36 left in the second quarter. The two-point conversion attempt failed. Sia stole some more momentum moments later when the home team recovered an Athens fumble at the 31-yard line with 6.31 left in the first half. Three plays later, Cody Leversey was in the end zone for the home team on a 12-yard touchdown run at the 5.52 mark for a 12-0 Panther lead, which turned out to be the final points of the game after the two-point conversion attempt was no good. The Athens defense also frustrated CS at times, stopping a Panther drive at the Athens 7-yard line. CS faced a 4th and 3 situation with 8.28 left in the 4th quarter, but the Panthers threw an incomplete pass, giving the visitors the ball back with a 12 nothing deficit and still time to come back. The Panther defense stood tall the rest of the game, and CS ran out the clock to secure the season opening win. Cody Leversey led the CS rushing attack with 73 yards on 10 carries, Taylor McNally added 58 yards on 11 carries, and Jeremy Shearer contributed 51 yards on 6 carries. Logan Hunter and Zach Mobley each had 7 tackles, with Hunter coming up with 1 interception, sophomore Ethan Simmons, who had 3 tackles, added 2 fumble recoveries. After the game, CS coach Kevin Langs and senior Levi McClish talked about the season opener, overcoming some adversity, and next week's opponent, New Buffalo. Coach Lang's uh, opening night here at Big Blue Stadium, um, just to share what it means to get right back out here in this football field. It's, uh, we call this the game of attrition when you play August football in Michigan. The humidity, the ball is wet, small school, so you don't have a lot of subs, so it's a lot of uh, a lot of excitement, a lot of excitement on the sidelines. I'm sure we all saw Tyler McNa or Taylor McNally put his lunch on the football okay. field. And, uh, so small schools, you know, you don't have a lot of uh, your two-way yeah, two players. Exciting to be out here, beautiful field. Please thank our maintenance crew, Mr. Yerby, Mr. Wade, who's awesome out here, and Trent Piper just did a great job. This field looks good. It does look good. Um, as far as the game itself, Kevin, um, Athens gave you folks a big battle tonight. They were one break away from getting back in there. Right, they were. We've had some, except for the last couple of years, you know, we had some great games with them in 06 and in 07. They were good, uh, a great team. And I thought this year, I think Jerry Jones has done a great job. A lot of compliments to him. I thought his team played uh, played tough tonight. Were the turnovers and penalties just kind of an opening night thing, or is that a concern you think moving forward? It's, it's got to be a concern, opening night or not. You know, I, I don't know how much the weather was that and how much okay. it was us. Uh, we'll have to see that a little bit. But yeah, we got to get better because our schedule gets tougher and tougher, so we got to find a way to get better. Now, you get uh, New Buffalo in the town next week. Uh, how are they going to be different from this Athens team? Spread. That's what, yeah. So if you want to see the ball all over the place and spread all over, come see New Buffalo. Different challenge. Now we got to make spatial plays versus power plays. And that'll be the challenge that'll be set for us. We saw a lot of points on the board last year with these two teams. Do you expect the same then? Well, 
not, I, I'd rather have a defensive battle. Yeah, yeah okay. I, I do expect I, there, it could be some more points than you saw. Today. Yeah. And finally, um, we'd like to bring a positive or two. What, what were some great things you saw out of this game from your team tonight? Again, we always start with the senior leadership. Like, you know, I thought Ethan Bosworth did a great job of gutting it out there. Quarterback, he was taking some hits. Uh, did a nice job. The offensive line is trying to get together so young in there. I just think it was the battling through the attrition and, and the adversity when you start getting on each other because things aren't going well. Uh, one of the reasons we play football. So, uh, I, I think the Sioux will do a great job of getting us together that way. That's great. Well, Coach, congratulations. We look forward to next week in New Buffalo. New Buffalo. Three. Levi McClish we got here. Um, Levi, just talk about getting back on that uh, football field here at Big Blue Stadium. It was really great. You know, I feel like we went out there. We all we all played hard. You know, we had good good game. But I feel like we had more intensity in us than what we showed. Um, I hope we bring that next game show what we're made of. I mean, first game get the jitters out. Yeah. I think we're good. Now, you showed a lot of character, I thought, tonight. Uh, Athens was a break or two away from, you know, getting right back in there. Yeah, you came up with some your team with some recovery, fumble recoveries and interceptions. Uh, it was really a game of attrition for you. Yeah, it is. Um, you know, I think we all were tired, mostly. We, sh we should have been hitting harder, playing harder. You know, nutrition comes a long way. Yep. I say more conditioning, more healthy food and less cramps, you know, yeah. we'll, be, we'll be out there. We'll be 100% by next game probably. What do you got to do to get better for next week, Levi, against a good new Buffalo team? You know, got to run hard, play harder, and, you know, change the diet. Can't have unhealthy food, you know. Yeah. yeah. Sure. Okay. Well, congratulations on your first win of the season, and we'll see you next week. Thank you very much. Now remember, CS will host New Buffalo September 5 at Big Blue Stadium at 7 p.m. Reporting live from Big Blue Stadium on opening night, this is Scoop for www.theclimaxcrescent.com. Good job. Yeah.